What's up guys? We're back again doing another Xbox One system update beta video and today's video we're going to talk about next month's July system update. We have four new features coming our way. I'll get straight into it and leave the best for last. First things first, it says like game DVR clips and smart glass. With the latest smart glass beta we're going to add the ability to like your favorite game DVR clips as well as your friends activity feed posts. So go ahead and give that special moment a like. So I'm not like I'm not in the smart glass beta so I can't even show you this feature whatsoever but with the system update I'm assuming that your smart glass app is gonna have an update that's gonna let you do all of those cool things so that's pretty neat uh, next thing it says choice of spoken language if you live in Ireland New Zealand or Australia you'll now be able to select voice control using English or German models from other countries so if that pertains to you what you would want to do is go to the settings app and uh, once you're here go over to system and from there you would go to language and and uh, location so you would select it and if you live in you know New Zealand Ireland or, or, or like Australia you would select one of those here and then go to spoken language and I'm assuming that from from changing that your spoken language list would change as well so if if, if this pertains to you that's how you would you would go about doing that and now my favorite two things snap mode for achievements you can now track your achievements progress in real time without ever leaving the game which is fucking awesome uh, you, you can also keep track of important achievements by moving them to the top or get the edge on any tough achievement with a new feature that will scan the web for you and deliver relevant tips and strategy content right to your TV so if if like you're like a big achievement hunter like I am and uh, you enjoy getting achievements this is gonna be pretty useful to you and it goes along with the other feature it says uh, double tap to snap you've been able to switch between main and snapped apps with a quick of uh, a double tap of the Xbox button but now you can pull up the snap center using the same press if you don't already have an app snap and it's perfect for pulling up that new achievement app so what uh, we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna start up Forza real quick to show you exactly how this works so the way that uh, the achievements snapped app would work is say like if you had Titanfall Forza or uh, you know Watch Dogs or something like that going you could snap the achievements app and it's gonna pull up uh, your achievements for that game so what we're gonna do is we're gonna double tap the Xbox button or you could just do it through uh, voice commands but we're gonna show off that new uh, double tap to snap feature so what, so the, what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, double tap the Xbox button and it's gonna you know uh, bring up all of this stuff right here so um, what we're gonna do is go to achievements and right here like as you can see up top it shows what my gamer tag is and what my gamer score is and as you can see it says we're on Forza 5 and so far I have 61 out of 102 achievements unlocked for this game with 775 gamer score out of 1400 for it so off to the left it, it shows it shows that I have 41 achievements that I have that I have yet to unlock for Forza and it shows your progress on those achievements which is pretty cool so say for instance for Ringer it says race and 50 multiplayer uh, events on uh, Nurburgring and it shows you that I have uh, exactly 32% uh, of that achievement so far unlocked and like off to the right it says we have 61 achievements that I have unlocked on this game and it'll actually show you all of them right here and you can actually click on it to actually show you what the badge and everything looks like like that and it'll show you more information on it but off to the left What's pretty cool is that say like if you're working on an achievement like I don't know, let's say uh, career minded. It says earn uh, 20 gold medals on Long Beach in career. It shows that, it, that we have 25% uh, so far of that achievement unlocked. What you can do is say like, like if you were more focused on uh, this achievement than a uh, pot of gold. What you can do is you can select it and hit move to top and now uh, career minded will be favorited as the number one thing they that like you're trying to complete so we can actually remove that from the top and it'll go back to where it was but say if you're having some uh, trouble with an achievement right and you want to look up on the internet some tips for that achievement um, what you can do is you can click on it and hit search for uh, for achievement help now this is a I mean 
you know, it, it says earn 400 gold medals in uh, career races, and it's a pretty straightforward achievement, so there's probably not going to be, you know, walkthroughs and tips for it, but uh, just to show it off, we're going to hit search for achievement help, and what it's going to do is, is it's going to launch your your app for the, like, Internet Explorer, and it's going to immediately bing um, that achievement help, so as you can see, it searched up Forza Motorsports 5 Golden Standard Achievement, and it's going to search the web for that, you know, uh, guides, reviews, things like that. But I mean, that's a pretty straightforward achievement. But say, like, if it was like a walkthrough for something, um, what would probably come up is uh, YouTube videos and things like that. But it's going to search the web for tips and things on how to get that achievement. So I think that's pretty neat, and it, it's uh, pretty seamless and fast. This, this app is pretty quick. Um, and if you want to go right back to your game, like all you got to do is hit B and we're right back to Forza. Uh, and you can go right back to go and hunt down uh, that achievement. So that's pretty cool. Um, I think that, that, uh, this is going to be uh, pretty awesome for uh, those of you like me who are, uh, um, you know, pretty big on achievements and, and hunting down achievements. So, uh, that's pretty awesome, and uh, that's it for the July system update. But the achievement snapping app is probably my favorite thing so far. Uh, it's just so convenient, and it's going to make your time hunting down achievements even that more enjoyable and convenient. So we're gonna we're gonna unsnap that, and we're gonna go back to the dashboard. So that's it for the July system update, people. If you enjoyed the video and and uh, you found it pretty helpful, please leave a like rating and and uh, comment how you feel about it. If you're new here and, and uh, this is your first time coming around to my channel, feel free to subscribe and uh, we're going to be doing more of, of these. Um, and if you want to follow me on, on uh, Twitter and you have some uh, questions, like all of that stuff will be in the uh, description box below. So I'll, I'll, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.